cricket at school? Formal, informal? No, no, no games. No games at no. school? No. The girls would be running around, the boys would be running around, and there'd be th perhaps half a dozen of us with the two old wooden stumps, as I said to you. So yeah, and, and there we used to have a, a knockabout at playtime. Yeah. And uh, uh, as I say, when we went home in the evening, you'd have a piece of cake or something and off back schoolyard and play cricket or football. Now, there was a retired headmaster you were mentioned. Yeah, Shaw, Mr. Shaw. Tell me about Mr. Shaw. Mr. Shaw was a great man in so many ways. He, t I, I, he taught my father, but he d didn't teach me. But he was retired in the village, and he was a great follower of cricket, particularly. He was a, played, I think, for Worcester seconds in his heyday, and he's still a member of Worcester right until he died. But when we were playing in the schoolyard, he used to come along in the evening or whenever it was, sometimes at playtime, about 11 o'clock, and he would look, if you were playing cricket, and then he would see that the batsman was in that bunch of his stumps, and he would walk over to him and he said, now look, get your bat and measure it from the stumps, a bat and the handle, and make your block all there. Right, now stretch forward. How far can you go forward like that? And he'd show him. And at the same time, he'd put a pigeon's feather there. And a pigeon's feather was for the bowler, because that was the ideal length to play to the batsman, to bowl to the batsman. And he always used to put a fox glassy mint on the stumps, so the bowler had that. That's <laughs> it's silly, I know. But then also, if you were batting, well, you know, keep the ball down, keep that wrist going over the wall. And he would give the batsman a fox glass he meant. And, but he was so good, he used to come through and he, he, he was quite gruff at times, but he always watched you. And uh, I mean, we didn't have proper bats. We had sawn off bats or homemade bats or whatever. <laughs> but the principles were the same. Bowl to the length and the batsman forward or back, and uh, never to be forgotten. The basis of coaching manuals today. So, so, so your early coaching was basically uh, being incentivised by Fox's glassy Yes. That's yeah, well, uh, I mean, it was so simple, but we respected him. 